what is going on guys so today we are checking out australia it's a whole different world and these photos are here to prove it so we're going to be looking at different photos of australia some cool things as we see here i have no idea what this is but yeah let's get on with it guys so we got a wave rock australia that is pretty interesting i must say wave rock i mean never seen anything as cool as this So yeah, it has a nice cool design. Camping in Australia. Yeah, and you have those parrots just laying around. Sexy calendars in Australia. Okay, I like how they have the kangaroo as a sexy calendar right there. Interesting. This accursed land. On Australia, this land is cursed. The animals hop, not run. The birds run, not fly, and the swans are black, not white. This land is cursed, and I'll have nothing more to do with it. <laughs> All right. Still a better receptionist than the one we had on the check-in, and they have a kangaroo just laying there. Wow. Honey, there's a kid on our bug. There's a kid on our bug. Okay, they just switched it the other way around. Wow. An emu egg I found a few years back in Australia. Is that actually real? Is that a real egg, bro? That's a cool color if that's true, bro. Meanwhile, in Australia. Yeah, we got the birds just drinking. Is that beer? Flashed all the cane toads out of my brothers. Damn. Some of them took the easy way out. Hitching a ride on the back of a 3.5 python. Wait, what are they? Are they frogs? Yeah, frogs on a bloody python, bro. Jeez. That's crazy. I'm stuck in Europe because of COVID and then my family took this photo and sent it from the camping trip at the Skinner's Creek, Victoria. Okay, now I'm really homesick. <laughs> the koala. Damn. Wow. Spencer Lake in Australia. Naturally pink. Bro, that is literally pink. As pink as it gets though. That is cool. That is cool. Wow. The Rue in a river. <laughs> Flexing in the river, taking a, a photo. This interesting plant is native to Australia. Wow, those are some... Bro, is that a real plant? They literally have a bird design on it. Bro, that is cool. Just pan over to the left, Barry. <laughs> Finally, something in Australia that doesn't want to kill me. Banana for scale. In Australia, this is why we check our shoes. Oh my God, bro. If I experience something like this, bro, it's game over with me. Having a bloody snake in your shoe. Guys, it's so bloody hot here in Australia at the moment. And I wonder why birds weren't using our bird bath. <laughs> this is how much food you can get for the cost of a pack of cigarettes in Australia. Seriously? Okay, that is so worth it, bro. That is so worth it. Don't expect thanks from Loretta if you find her. <laughs> yeah, she squirts. Okay, okay. <laughs> Selling point for Aussie school. Whole school air conditioned. <laughs> wow. Rose breasted cockatoo, aka pink and grey. Wow, she is sexy. A six month old baby kangaroo I am raising is a very impatient at bottle time. Right, just like dogs, right? And cats. You know, you're in Australia when frogs eat snakes. Okay, okay. No way that's real, bro. No way that is real. Seriously. Typical roadside ditch in Australia. 
crocodile eating a shark? Damn, never seen that before. Snakes active in this area. Please flush before use. Maybe I'll just hold on. Nah, bro. Too hot for Jesus in Queensland. Too hot to keep changing signs. Good, God, good sin, bad details inside. <laughs> what do we have here? He came down through the fireplace and trashed the place. Ate my banana and jumped on me at 2 a.m. That's crazy, bro. That is crazy. What animal is that? I've never seen an animal like that before. Interesting. Okay. Summer in Australia. Yeah. We find the spot of shade and all animals are just laying there. Fair enough. They did not find the 147 a litre amusing. <laughs> Rainbow Ross caught off Christmas high. No way, bro. Is that a real fish? Bro, people discovering fish like this. I mean, bro, that is insane. Seriously. Two extremely cute endangered barking geckos. Waring, waring? I don't know what that means. I put my hand on a cold morning in Western Australia. These are the only two I've ever come across, so it was pretty awesome. <laughs> I, I've never seen these before. I don't know if they're dangerous or not, but yeah, that's an interesting color. March of the Hairy Caterpillars. Oh my God. Bruh. Whatever your view on today, respect your neighbors. <laughs> Here we go, one, two, three kangaroos just laying on the backyard. That's life, right? This tree in the dying tree rainforest. Wow. Wow, bro. That is so cool. Look at that, bro. It's just like, like this. Just like this, bro. Okay. Lizard in, in Australia. An emu just cruising around my rural towns, little airport. Okay, okay. Australian moth. What on earth is that, bro? Jeez, Australia. You you guys got some crazy animals. 40 degrees up north, Victor Day. Had a little visitor come and smack the door with his tail before taking a dip in our pond. <laughs> Just giving them a heads up, you know. My daughter's boyfriend has been helping out his parents' farm in Kingaroy. Kingaroy, okay. Queensland. He took this shot when the sheep came up to say good day. <laughs> wow. Why are you littering? Why are you littering? Okay, yeah. I am a jerk. Ticked. I don't care about natural areas. Ticked. Mummy still cleans up, up after me. All of the above. Okay. I see you put them outside your window and raise your raise you our break and enter culprit last night. Okay, I don't really get this to be honest. Australia. Where even the hail can kill you? Oh, no, wait, wait, are those real sized pool table balls? Because if that is, bro, I mean, that hailstone, that can crack through your head, honestly. That's scary. My physics teacher defended her house for bushfires by herself and then waited out the fire in her pool using a scuba tank. Smart, smart, I must say. New coat of arms for Australia. What is this? Okay. That's a blue ring octopus whose venom can result in death. Yeah, I've heard about these, bro. These can literally kill you. It's crazy. It's literally crazy, bro. The kids are alright. We'll be less 
activist if you be less. <laughs> Our cat came home after missing in the fires for seven nights. She's burned but should live. We thought her lost when the fire consumed most of our property. Best feeling ever to walk out and see her alive. Okay. Wow, okay. Interesting. Anyways, guys, I think I will end the video here. And we will continue with this on the next video. So if you want to see more of this, guys, like the video, subscribe to the channel and wait for part two. I'll upload it in a few days. So stay tuned, guys. Hope you enjoyed. And yeah, see you on the next one. Peace out, guys.